if y'all ain't shopping at the Dollar Tree, what are you doing? I'd like to say that all of the Dollar Trees are created equal, but honestly, y'all, we scoured every Dollar Tree in our area to give you guys the best and cutest Easter and spring decor items to DIY with. Let's just go ahead and start going through these bags. There's so much goodness this year. I think with the three to five dollar section, they really hooked me in. And there's some super cute items that I just have to show you all. Okay, so you all can see I've obviously got a lot. I really don't even know where to start. Let's just start this way and work our way down. Um, I wanna start with some floral options that they've got. So these are super cute. I've never seen these little moss bunnies at the Dollar Tree, but like, are you kidding me? They're so cute, super classy. And then floral moss is always a good thing to have on hand whenever you're making crafts, especially spring crafts, because you can add it in as filler and use it in so many different ways. One thing that I have been loving from the Dollar Tree are these wooden cutouts. They are so cute. They've got little holes in them, so you can make these into garland. They've got a plethora of different shapes, so they've got bunnies and carrots. And y'all, look how cute these are. They're like little wooden bunnies with little cotton tails, and these can be added to so many different DIY projects. There's about 12 of these in each pack, so a little bit is gonna go a long way. They've even got these bigger bunny cutouts that are so cute. This one's got a little tail on it. Um, I just really love these. I feel like they look really high end, especially if you use them the right way. And we're gonna be using these in so many different Easter DIYs this year because they just look so good and such good quality. They also have this cute little bunny and these little MDF trucks. I just love these, you all. You can use them in so many different ways. Dollar Tree has offered a few of these metal items, but I feel like they're getting a wider range recently, especially with that three to five dollar aisle. And the crafter square selection has just really gone up. I don't know if it's just our Dollar Tree or everywhere. Honestly, I feel like somebody at Dollar Tree has really stepped up their crafting game or their crafting knowledge because we have so many cute options now for craft products at the Dollar Tree. Like this, all you would have to do is add some vinyl onto this. Like, so, so cute. They've even started offering things like this burlap banner. You can add vinyl to this. I think it'd be really cute to put the little wooden bunnies on it and put like spring or something like that. And these are only six flags long, but you could easily connect these to make them as long as you wanted. These self-adhesive wall tiles, we have been using like crazy. We use them all through the holiday season, and now we're gonna start using these on our wood signs and our wood cutouts for the Easter and spring season. So these are super, super cute. Typically we'll paint over them and then kind of sand on top of them to distress it a little bit. And they offer different types of patterns. This one tends to be our favorite, so we buy this pattern a lot, but they have quite a bit of choices for you to choose from. This is another thing. I feel like they started offering these last year. I hadn't seen them before then, but these are the high cloche dome. And this is like five and a half inches, almost six inches. You can pop these off and add whatever you want here in the bottom and then pop it back on. You can add twinkle lights, little bunnies, carrots, whatever, an Easter scene, whatever. The options are endless but I just think that these are so cute. And honestly, you can paint the bottom of these so the colors match whatever you're putting in there. I just feel like they're a very versatile craft product to use. So this is just some gift tissue. I wouldn't necessarily say that this is an Easter item, but this is great for when we want to Mod Podge pretty springy colors onto our wood shapes. And I think I'm gonna use this on some of those wooden cutout bunnies, just because I feel like this would look so, so cute on them. And then add them to the banner. I'm feeling like that's gonna be a super cute little DIY. So these items are non-spring slash Easter. They're typically just offered all throughout the year in different color options at the Dollar Tree. Um, these little buckets are so good to add some fake flowers to. You could even put little eggs in these as decoration. And then of course, these little wire baskets are so, so cute. And then I just have to say, this is probably my newest favorite thing from the Dollar Tree. These are in the back typically with all of the baskets and stuff. Um, $1.25 in like in this beautiful mint green color, 
There's also other options, like they've got a blush, they've got a baby blue, and they're just so pretty and so springy. And I thought this would be super cute as an Easter basket for the kids. So you can put in things like little bunny ears or books or things like that. And you can even add tags to these and it would just be super, super cute. These are something new that I had never seen in the Dollar Tree before. And maybe I just missed it last year or the couple years before that. But these little pom poms are so cute. These would be perfect on garland perfect to add to your little bunny cutouts. And they offer them in two different sizes, which I really, really appreciate. And then they've also started offering these little felt sheets, which you can totally cut with your Cricut. And I just love them because they've got them in the carrot color. So you could totally cut some little carrots out of this felt using your Cricut. Next, I want to show you all all of the egg options that they've got at the Dollar Tree. So these have been at the Dollar Tree every year for years. I have used these in my home decor and everywhere else in between. I really, really love how these look. But this year, I have never seen these, but they have half a dozen little golden eggs in here. And honestly, I feel like you can make these look super high end by like kind of distressing them. I just feel like this color is so unique and different, but I feel like you could really level it up by adding some like distressing on the outside of them. And then they've got these little tiny craft eggs. These would be great for painting and adding as filler for other projects. So florals for us are always kind of a hit or miss from the Dollar Tree. It really depends on the project that we're making. So we grabbed some of these little blue flowers and then I saw this one that I was thinking might be cute to go in like one of these little glass votives. I would obviously take it out of the little pot that it's in, but I feel like that would be so stinking cute just as a little shelf decor. And then this year they're also offering these cute little tulips in this tin can. This is in the three to five dollar aisle. Um, if you all have not been to the Dollar Tree in a minute, in the last year, they are offering a 3 to $5 section. So everything is a little bit more elevated. And I really, really love this. Honestly, y'all, if I didn't want the florals, I would take it just for this little tin can. Something that I really appreciate from the Dollar Tree is their selection of glass items. So these are one of the most popular and favored glass pieces. These are just the tall cylindrical vases and they offer them in a couple different sizes. They've got this little circle globe sphere, which I really, really love. And they've even got the cutest little dessert plates. They actually offer full size plates too. And they not only offer them in white, but they have other colors and they also have other shapes. So like square plates as well as round plates. These are great to add water slide decals to and even vinyl. We're getting close to the end of our haul. I'm so sad, but I wanna go over a few more things before we are finished. Um, one thing that I really love to get from the Dollar Tree are these wreath forms. So they've got lots of different options. They've got the square, the circle, and they've got this really cute little wheel. This is giving me farmer's market, door hanger wreath vibes. Really love that. And then um, around the spring and Easter time, they will offer the little cross ones. Christmas, they've got tons of options, things like that. So if you were really into wreath making and you did not know that the Dollar Tree offered these, make sure to stop in next time you're near Dollar Tree and snatch them up. Another reform option would be the styrofoam rings. These are really good for adding flowers to. You could make a money wreath. Lots of different options for these styrofoam reforms. So when we first saw these kneeling pads in the store, I thought, eh, we don't need those, not for a craft project. But then we got to thinking it would be really cute to cut out some different shapes out of these, like Easter related shapes, and maybe paint them and put them on a shelf maybe. Um, we're gonna try out that craft and just see how it works. But sometimes it's good to kind of think outside of the box whenever you're looking for craft supplies. Sometimes it's good whenever you are shopping for craft supplies to kind of think outside the box and maybe not go for things that are directly craft supplies like Crafter Square or in the paint section or anything like that and start grabbing stuff like this and think, how can I make this into a really cute DIY? 
Something I've always loved about the Dollar Tree is their ribbon selection and their gift wrap selection. So they're offering this beautiful wired gingham ribbon for $3 in the $3 to $5 section. Or even you could use something like this silky off-white kind of pastel yellow ribbon just for gift wrapping or decor purposes and then they've always got this decorative shred i really love to use this to fill up baskets the brown craft paper color is so versatile and you can use it across so many different crafts so this is the last item that i want to show you all this is brand new to the dollar tree and it is so cute so what they've done here is taken a bottle brush tree they flipped it upside down and they added a little stem and a base so these are really cute on their own i i mean i feel like you could put this on a shelf and it would be super cute but what we we're kind of thinking is about snipping that base off and then adding this to one of the gold hoop wreath forms and then making it kind of like a door hanger situation so stay tuned for that because we're going to see if that's going to work or be cute at all um, like I said earlier, I think it's good just to, we just really want to encourage you all to think outside of the box. I hope after seeing this video, you all are feeling inspired to create your own DIY spring and Easter projects. And if this is the first video that you've seen of ours, make sure that you click that subscribe button and click the link in the description below. It's going to give you a little bit more insight into what we do over here at Makers Gonna Learn. So we are a membership-based crafting community, and we would really love for you all to be a part of that community with us. Stay tuned for all of the Easter and Spring DIYs that we are gonna do with this entire Dollar Tree haul, and we will see you all over in the next one. Bye!